G'day viewers. Well, the Trans-Pacific Partnership got signed by 12 Pacific Rim countries today. And when we say Pacific Rim, I feel like I should be doing some sort of metaphor about kaiju attacking us poor innocent people. And where the hell are our Jaegers that are going to protect us? Because a lot about the TPP seems bad. Some people say, why didn't you tell us about this sooner? I did. I have been making videos about this literally for years, okay? Because this negotiation's been going on for about five years, and it's been done in secret, which is the creepiest thing about it. We would get some leaked information from the drafts, and it was always bad. And also you can tell it was bad because someone was leaking it. They weren't allowed to officially come out and say, ha, huh, this is in it. So when they saw something horrible, they went, ugh, people should probably know this. And it's flown under the radar, but now, this is actually only the first stage of it coming into being. There's a whole bunch of other agreements that have to come on and be ratified by each country has to ratify it with their internal political processes and they're allowing up to two years to do this. So it might not come through. But the big thing is, now maybe we'll see what it actually is. Because the parts we have seen before from drafts were pretty bad and the worst ones seem to allow corporations to actually interfere with the laws of sovereign countries. Actually, do you ever say, oh, no, that thing that you care about, whether it be the environment or labor laws or anything else, oh, we think that interferes with our profits, so you're not allowed to do it. Yes, a foreign company could actually dictate the laws of your country. That sounds awesome, doesn't it? The US has pushed this as trying to be uh, a counter against the growing economic power of China. And China's doing all this, oh, well, this seems like everyone's going to play nice, doesn't it? But it seems like they, you know, are really worried about it and they want to be part of it. Because particularly if European nations start signing on to this, it could really threaten China. So that bit appears to be doing what America wants. But of course, uh, being driven by America... Obama says it's good, so therefore, automatically, Republicans say it's bad. This might be one of those stages where I actually like the fact idiot Republicans reflexively reject anything Obama says, because they might reject this. Because, honestly, the idea of corporations being elevated even further above people like you and me, well, that's just ten kinds of fucked.